Here's another uh, great mobility tool to use if you have a tight piriformis or if your TFL is kind of out of control. I did recently post a psoas exercise to kind of strengthen your psoas and release your um, TFL, your tensor fascia latte. So go ahead and watch that one, for, but for this one I'm just going to go ahead and get right into the piriformis. And you can do this on a chair or on the ground. So I'm going to demo the chair one at first and then I'm going to go ahead and take it to the floor. So we're taking our lacrosse ball or any kind of ball that you have, let's say if you have like a soft dog toy or even like, like a softball, really any kind of ball will work for this. So you're going to take this, we want to have it right on the outside of our tailbone here. So this is our sacrum, so we want to be right on the outside because it comes all over here, kind of goes across. I'm going to bring it right across here. I'm going to go ahead and sit, put some pressure on it, and I'm going to go ahead and wrap my leg around the top. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and go back and forth with scrubbing motions. So I'm going to scrub, scrub while I'm holding on to this leg. Scrubbing, because this is going to go ahead and open up those muscles. Scrub, back and forth. I can lean into it more to get a little bit more. I can back off to get a little bit less. I'm just going to go ahead and scrub. And if I want, I can also push that leg open as well to kind of help open and stretch while we're doing this. And you can also use both hands on the side of the chair there for a little bit more support. So I would say do about a minute on each side and make sure you're breathing. So we're going to find a good spot. Ooh, that spot's tight. I'm going to go ahead and do contract and relax once I find a really good spot. I'm going to hold. I'm going to fight myself. Three, two, one. Do about a four to five second breath out while we take, also take a deep breath in. Make sure you're breathing through your diaphragm. Four, three, I'm fighting it. Two, one, contract and relax. I'm going to relax. I'm going to go ahead and work right back into it. So we want to do contract and relaxing. I would say about five times on each side. We're going to take it, come up, find the spots. And I would do about a minute or two on each side, whatever preference you have. If, if it feels a little bit tighter, you can go longer. Um, scrub, same thing. Contract, five, four, three, two, one. Relax and you want to go ahead and sink onto that ball. We have to make sure we're breathing in this position. All right, if you guys have any other questions, definitely uh, let me know. But here is your, uh, your movement for on the chair. And then if you also want to do it on the ground, it's the same thing. Here, get it set up. We wrap and then we go from side to side, just like this. And then we go contract, push, four, three, two, one. Relax, and then we keep going with that movement. Right? Get into it. See how it goes.